start with a fresh face. I've already washed mine and I've done some toner. Next I have the Avon Recovery Cream. So I'm just going to put that all over the areas where I think I get most of the irritation. So the whole makeup look I'm going to do today is a little simple so I want to make sure that my face makes up for it. I mean the base. So I want to create a dewy look. I'm starting with the Revlon Photo Ready Skin Lights and it's an illuminator so I'm just going to put it all over the areas where the sun would naturally hit my face. Next up is concealer. So I'm going to use this BYS concealer kit and I have this habit now of using the salmon or this pinky um, peach color first. I'm going to put that all over my eye bags. This already makes such a big difference if you could just compare that to the other side. And I'm also going to put a little bit of the same color on the redness around my nose so it will become neutral. Next I'll use this color which is very yellowish on the same areas where I put the peachy pink cream. So this is supposed to highlight the areas. Over everything, I'm going to mix two foundations. I think I already told you in my previous video on why I have to mix. It's because I bought the wrong color. So this is the Revlon Age Defying Firming Lifting Makeup in Tender Beige. And Maybelline Dream Liquid Mousse in Natural Beige Medium 2.5. And I'm going to use this beauty sponge to pat it all over my face. For my cream contour, I'm going to use this BB um, Gosh Cream. It's actually a foundation, but it's some shades darker than my skin color, so this will be perfect for the contour cream. This is given to me by Archie. Thank you, super super model. <laughs> so I'm going to put it at the hollows of my cheeks, sides of my face, sides of my nose, and everywhere I want to look more narrow or thinner or slimmer. I'm also putting some under my lower lip so that it creates an illusion that I have a fuller lower lip. To set everything, I'm using Ben Nye Cameo Powder using this Real Techniques buffing brush. So I'm gonna lightly pat everything into place. For powder contouring, I'm using this LA Spice, or sorry, LA Girls um, Blush Kit. This is um, in Spice, and I'm using a marionade angled brush. And I'm just gonna go through all the areas where I put cream contour earlier. I love this fan brush so much. It's so perfect for putting highlighter on my face. and. Here I am doing it now. I'm gonna put some on my upper lip, on the bridge of my nose, and on the sides, or the apples, tops. What? Tops of my cheeks. Now I'm gonna use the usual product I use for my brows. This is BYS in Natural Brown, and I'm using a Marinade Eyebrow Brush. You know how I do it. I put some product and I go through it with the spoolie, and that's that's just how it is for me. To set my brows in place, I have this Maybelline Brow Mascara. I don't remember the color, so I will just put it in the description box below. And that's it. For the eyes, I'm going to use this um, product from Etude House. This is Golden Ratio and I'm going to put it all over my lid and this will serve as my primer. Mm -hmm. 
After the primer, I'm gonna use a shadow from Mallorca, Mallorca, Majolica, Majorca. I'm sorry, I don't know how to say it. I'm gonna use this brush. Um, wait, I can't see what the color is, but I think it's BE121. It doesn't have an English name, so I'm sorry. Then I have this The Nudes palette from Maybelline. It's not exactly my favorite, and I've been vocal to my friends about it. It's just not as pigmented as I wanted it to be, but then again, for such a prize, you know, what do you expect? So, um, first I used the gray slash brown color um, for the crease. And now I'm putting gold on the, or in the, on the corner of my eyes. God, prepositions. With a small flat brush, I'm gonna use the same colors I used for the upper lid. I'm gonna bring that down, and I'm just gonna do that smudging um, effect. Next is eyelashes. Um, these are fiber mascara. This is a fiber mascara from Mayalika. For the lashes, I'm using Red Cherry Eyelashes in TW, and I'm using a Nichido uh, glue for that. So um, I think I've mentioned this in the previous video, but I don't put a lot of glue when I put on falsies because I find that it's easier to remove. Next is an eyeliner, sorry, a lip liner from, where is this from? Pinky's Collection, and this is an Atlantic. Then I'll top that off with the NYX Soft Matte Lip Cream in London. And that's it. So this is your muted nude lip simple eye makeup look. Um, thank you for watching. Stay weird.